Java all white, right? Couldn't hit it if you niggas had I Lanes can't call and you lie. You had it and you lost it all the time. All the time. Baby, you don't know what you do to me Between me and you, I feel a chemistry I won't let no one come and take your place Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced So go now, and what you do That's why I'm not in my life with you I won't please you anywhere I can I won't share my world, don't you understand?
back to my channel welcome back to another episode of keeping up with coco if you're new to my channel make sure you hit the subscribe button turn on your post notifications and follow me on instagram at birkin coco you know how to spell birkin and you know how to spell coco welcome to another vlog miss video i believe today is the 22nd of december we only have about five days until christmas and then we only have about two weeks until the new year 2023 i'm super excited i've been dropping these vlogs back to back back to back now all haven't been consisted with you know christmas stuff but this vlog obviously as you can see from the beginning i was cleaning my house then i did my christmas tree i put it up i don't know if you guys can see it in the background i put it up i cleaned my entire house because my house was disgusting well not disgusting <laughs> my house is never dirty but you know me um so i cleaned my house and now i am dressed because i need to actually run back to hermes a lot of you guys know i have a new boo a new sugar daddy a new boyfriend <laughs> whatever you want to call him um he took me to turks and caicos and i don't know if i have told you guys on my youtube but your girl is a retired hoe okay he don't retired your girl um i have an authorized card with no limit to his business account so we've been doing this thing where we're getting a gift for each other um every day until christmas and it started yesterday so yesterday if you were on my live on instagram birkin coco follow me you saw that i unboxed my boots i'm actually wearing them now because one thing about me when I buy something, it's because I like it and I'm going to wear it. So I bought it yesterday and I unboxed it yesterday and I'm wearing it today. I actually have to go back to Hermes. They're closing in like 40 minutes, so I'm quickly doing this. And I have to run, um, I texted my sales associate. I got him a belt and with his money, obviously. And the belt didn't fit, it was a little small, so I have to go back and pick up a bigger size. And then I have to run to the mall because I need to get him a gift for today. And then we are going to dinner. So, yeah. Um, today has been kind of a productive day. I posted a new vlog. My first vlog of, you know, Turks and Caicos. Go check that vlog out. I'm going to leave it up here. Um, and then tomorrow is going to be part two. I cleaned up my house. I put up my Christmas tree. It smells so good in here. Ugh, okay. I also ordered some hair from Kendra's Boutique with his card. That was the first thing I ordered. <laughs> Well, it's my card. It's just connected to his bank account. I don't know why I keep saying with his card. It's it's my card. It has my name on it. It's just connected to his bank account and I have no limit. I can spend it as much as I want. I can pay all my bills with it. Your girl is retired. I might be married in six months or something. <laughs> you feel me? Um, but yeah, so let me show you guys my outfit. Alright, so this is my outfit. I'm wearing this dress that I got from Aritia like two years ago. It's a long sleeve. It's kind of like a turtleneck, but it's short. It has this slit. It's kind of sexy. Honestly, if I had stockings, I would have worn them inside, but my stockings are ripped. So yeah, I need to order some new ones. And then I have the Hermes boots that I literally just got yesterday. Um, Chanel staring at me because She's trying to figure out what I'm doing. Hi, Chanel. I know you're coming with me, okay? Relax. Um, so yeah, I am gonna throw on like a little cardigan that's long, so it's gonna make it a little bit more classy. Um, but let me show you the box. Um, so this is the box that the boots came out of. You can see these go in the thingy. These are the dust bags. Dust bags. So this I'm keeping. But I need to take this back because I got him a belt and the belt doesn't fit and it comes with these um, removable buckles for the front. That's the really cool thing about Hermes belts for men. You can buy them one and it's reversible black brown and he can switch out the buckles, buy a new one whenever. So I have to take this back actually today, exchange it, and then I need to run to the mall. It closes at seven to buy him something for today. But 
this is my outfit it's cute i love these boots <laughs> um black boots are the thing for the winter okay with a dress all you're showing is your thighs boom cute um for earrings i have my van cleave earrings those are like earrings i wear every day they're just so much easier bracelet uh cartier cartier and then i have my hermes bracelet cartier rings for perfume i'm wearing my le labo let's see if it's gonna focus mm, i'm wearing my le labo perfume that i got rose 31 it smells so good let's grow a little bit more boom boom this cardigan is cashmere and I think I threw it in my dryer for too long and seeing that I'm wearing long sleeves a little tight but I'm about to walk like this it's cute it's fine besides we like to take ubers so we're gonna go from uber to restaurant restaurant into uber I drive and I park my car at his house so this is the final look but Let's run and go to Hermit. Okay, I lied. I ended up going with my Burberry jacket. It's brown, matches my bag. I'm taking my Dior bag. And yeah, this is the final look. Baby, you don't know what you do to me. Between me and you, I feel a chemistry. I won't let no one come and take your place. Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced. So go now, and what you do. That's why I'm not in my life with you. I won't please you in any way I can. I won't share my world. Don't you understand? next day today is wednesday december 21st now i know when i started the vlog yesterday i said it was the 22nd i lied it was the 20th i really don't know dates because i don't live a life where i really need to know what day it is <laughs> i really don't um but it was tuesday the 20th yesterday and today is the 21st it is 2 47 in the afternoon what you saw me do earlier was basically i showed you guys my a final christmas tree because you guys saw me i was putting it up yesterday i was cleaning my house looks beautiful it smells so clean and i'm so happy with it um and then i was doing some work i was editing my uh turks and caicos part two vlog part one went up yesterday so make sure you guys go and check out those two vlogs um right now i'm about to do my makeup i've showered brushed my teeth mm -hmm. and i have actually also gotten dressed so now i just need to curl my hair a little bit put some foundation and we are running to the store because i need to go and get day three gift for my new boo um i don't know if i told you guys this yesterday but we are doing this thing where um well personally it was me it was my idea because i knew i was gonna benefit but um i said we should get gifts for each other every day until christmas and it started two days ago so yesterday was day two um i will show you guys my gift in a second um today is day three so i need to go get him a gift um I don't know if I explained, but I got an authorized card that is connected to his business. And so I'm not using my money to buy him gifts. I'm using his money to buy him gifts, but it's the thought. <laughs> At least this is how he says it. It's the thought that counts um, of me picking out things for him because he doesn't have a kid. Let's let Chanel uh, finish. Thank you. 
She's gonna stop eventually. Let's wait. Oh, are you done? Okay. So, <laughs> he has no kids and he's never been married, right? <sighs> Chanel, if you don't cut it out, cut it out. All right. So, you know, I am the person to buy him gifts and obviously I always tell you guys we don't we don't spend our money to buy men gifts. He's retired your girl, okay? <laughs> I think I talked about it on my Instagram, but I don't think I've talked about it on here. But your girl is a retired. Okay, I don't need three, four, five, six, seven boyfriends anymore. I just need one. Okay, I told you guys I just needed one that was able to do everything for me. Um, somebody was like, does he have a private jet? No, he doesn't have a private jet. But I'm not really, you know, I'll take first class guaranteed everywhere we go, which is his thing. So I'm cool with that. Okay. He, he likes to spend money on me. Okay. I don't know. He's not like a splurger on himself, even though I've been splurging on him quite a lot with his money. So I got him an Hermes belt. Um, and then yesterday I got him a YSL, um, what do you call it? A uh, money holder or money clip or wallet whatever you want to call it um and then today i'm gonna go get him some cologne um i also got him something really really nice he actually mentioned one in it so i got him something really really nice but that's for christmas and this is all from his money for me he got me the hermes boots you guys saw me wear yesterday and yes i wear something right away he got me the hermes boots and then yesterday he got me these Van Cleef earrings. Now hear me out. I will show you the uh, earrings in a second, but it's the thought that counts, okay? He needed to get me something really nice. So he got me these $3,000 Van Cleef earrings, but I'm going to switch them out because they're not in a style that I actually like. And I think they will have to like ship in the one that I actually like, which, which is kind of like the ones that I already have. Um, that I wore yesterday and you guys saw that and then he also got me a Van Cleef bracelet so because I was going to go exchange the earrings today he just told me to pick up the bracelet so I'm super excited about that so your girl got <laughs> your girl got Hermes boots for day one Van Cleef earrings for day two and a Van Cleef bracelet for day three and we still have four days <laughs> till Christmas. Anyway, so um, what I'm about to do is put some makeup on and then we are going to go ahead and, you know, do this shop, get him his cologne. I don't know what to get him. I'm going to have to go smell around, find something, and then I'm going to go pick up my bracelet. And then I'm also going to exchange the earrings that I will show you guys in a second. Um, yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, guys. So this is kind of like a YouTube update because I tell my girls on Instagram a lot when things happen so make sure you're following me on instagram because then you see it right away wait until i post a video to find out so make sure you're following me on instagram um i'm also trying to do tiktok <laughs> i'm trying to get into doing tiktok so i've been uh filming which i should do right now i've been trying to do like a a, a day in a life vlog today but I don't know. How did the gals do it? <laughs> How did the girls do it? Because it's a lot of work. Doing YouTube, editing videos, Patreon, subscribe to my Patreon, trying to do a TikTok. Like I can't. That's why most of the time my TikToks are just like vacations. I don't talk. I don't dance on TikTok. I don't know how people do it. It's too much work. Okay, I'm just trying to be a kept woman, which is basically what this man's trying to do for me right now so yeah a little bit of foundation if you care i'm using the um 
Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Foundation. I'm pretty sure I've shown you guys this before. Um, yeah. Also, I was on my period, so I had like these humongous ass pimples on my head. But they're going away, so works out. Works out for me. Should I do like a little like this? I need to get a real vanity uh, mirror from my closet, which is basically the next thing I'm going to be buying with this card. Um, I got myself some Kendra Boutique hair. Um, <laughs> that was the first thing I bought when he gave me the card. I ordered some hair. Remember I was telling you ladies, I'm not about to spend my money personally, $500 on some goddamn hair. It's just not my thing. I don't care. Some people want to spend thousands of dollars on their wigs every three months. I'm not doing that. But since it's somebody else's money, why not, right? Um, so that's what I ordered with his, uh, with his money. My money. Our money. <laughs> um... Someone on Instagram was like, what is your daily limit? Like, spend at least $300. Bitch, what? $300? My shoes cost more than $1,000. I don't have a daily limit. I don't have a monthly limit. I don't have a weekly limit. I just have the card, and I can spend it as much as I want. And I can transfer myself a certain amount every month. So I feel comfortable about, you know, my bank account growing. Because my bank account has to grow. <laughs> okay? It's not just his card. It is my bank account has to grow as well. So I do write a check to myself from his bank account into my bank account every month. So that I can, you know, have money in case, God forbid... We break up. That was the uh, requirement to uh, me uh, <laughs> dating him and basically uh, retire my whole life, which it was fun, but I was ready. I was ready. I was ready to move on to better and better things. So if you see me pop out with a ring, pop out with a ring. <laughs> Do not be surprised, okay? Do not be surprised if you see me pop out with a ring, guys. And just know your girl will be set for life. At least that's what he says. <laughs> Why do I do? <laughs> I'm, I'm foul. I did tell him, though. But why did I try calling the card um, to access his bank account? <laughs> To see how much money he had inside. <laughs> Why? Why did I do that? But I needed the last four of his social security, which I don't know. Obviously, I probably will eventually find out one day. Maybe when he proposes to me or something. But I was like, oh, let me go in there. And uh, <laughs> let me call. Because you know, the card is in my name. So I'm like, okay, I have my card that has my name on it. And then I have, um, you know, the pin for my card. So I was like, oh, okay, so I can just call because I have Chase. He has Bank of America. So I'm like, I should be able to just call and like put in the card number and put in the um, uh, code for the card and get how much is in the fucking <laughs> account. But obviously I was calling from my phone and my phone isn't connected to his bank account just his phone so because i was calling from a different phone they didn't recognize it they were like oh um we're gonna need the last <laughs> we're gonna need the last four of the social security so i couldn't get the information that i was looking for and so i ended up just telling him 
he wasn't angry, but he was just like, you could have just asked me. But then I was like, it was wrong. I shouldn't have done it. So I didn't even bother to like press him on the issue. But he basically told me I'd be set for life if I was to get married to him. And something was to happen to him. <laughs> so I was like, well, that's all I need to hear then. <laughs> That sounds so bad. <laughs> I'm such a bad person. Just kidding, I'm actually a good person. I'm a very great person. Um, I'm trying to put some mascara on my eye, hold on. But yeah, I need a real vanity mirror because this ain't cutting it. If you guys know of any good vanity mirrors, please let me know down in the comments because... Mm. I need something better than this. This is just a regular mirror that I just put on this um, desk that has my makeup organized in it that I got from Ikea. I don't know if I'm gonna have to order a whole vanity or can I just get a vanity mirror with lights so I can see what I'm doing. Cause that was the time when I'm putting makeup on. Well, I don't really do much anyways. I just put foundation. Sometimes I do the little under eye thing. I do a little bit of curls on my, I need to go get my other wig for my mom. <laughs> I gave her a wig. I lended my mom my wig. Because my mom has a low cut. She likes short hair. She cut her hair. So, I cut her hair as a matter of fact. She makes me like shave her hair. For some reason my mom thinks I'm a barber. So I cut her hair for her and I made the mistake of cutting it too low. I felt bad. I was like, I took the wig off my head and I gave it to her so she could go to work. But she ended up not wearing it. She just wore her hair basically bald. And she was okay with it. So, I gotta go get it back. <laughs> On my ear. And voila. <laughs> And some lip gloss. <laughs> like that. It really don't take much. <laughs> it really doesn't take much for me to be fucking pretty like what the hell they really just be giving i'm a pretty bitch <laughs> mm. Mm, 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 mm. i'm gonna do a slight slight contour oh it's right here I'm a 27, and why is my wisdom tooth the top one? Just not bothering me. So now I have to go to the dentist. I have a clean up tomorrow. I need to go. I'm getting my teeth cleaned tomorrow. And then after that, I have to schedule to get my, um, my wisdom tooth this one the two in the bottom grew in when i was in high school um and they were hurting when i was in high school but i never got them removed and they just kind of grew into place i don't know if that's why i have canines Ugh, bite a bitch um but i've always had canines growing up so 
my um, dentist, the guy that did my veneer from my chipped tooth on the top, I told him that I wanted to do Invisalign and he was like, you don't need to do that. Everyone have canines or something. Or he was like, um, it's a... Uh, <laughs> He was like, oh, you don't need to do that. Keep them. They give a little bit of character. Actually, I don't know if I told you guys. If you guys ever watched that, um, I got my veneers done by da-da-da-da. Um, he actually told me when I was going in to get my veneers for my chipped tooth. He was like, why are you doing that? He was like, you have really nice white teeth. Like, my teeth was white as fuck. He was like, you have really nice white teeth. And people come in here and they try to get your color teeth. He was like, you just need to clean your teeth, like get like a random clean up. And then he was like, I think your cheap tooth gives you character. I think he was flirting with me a little bit. He was like, I think your cheap tooth gives you character. And I was like, well, you know, I had someone because Birkin Daddy, thank you if you watch this video. Birkin Daddy offered to fix them. So I was like, well, you know, a boyfriend offered to fix it. So I'm just going to take it because he offered. I wasn't going to spend my money. He got me fucked up. So he was like, okay, well, if you want to do it, do it. But he was like, he thinks that it wasn't necessary. Uh, and so that's why I was like, okay, well, I'm not going to do Invisaligns for this canines. Besides, I might have to fight a bitch one day and use my teeth. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I'm going back to the same place to get my teeth cleaned. Even though they look clean as fuck. Um, and then I need to get my wisdom tooth, this one on the top, pulled because it's been killing me for the last two weeks. It kind of started when I went to um, Morocco. And I was like, what the hell is going on? Yeah, like, like my jaw right here hurts. That's because this fucking tooth needs to be pulled out, so... That's what we're gonna do. We're probably gonna schedule it for after Christmas. Um, because it's Christmas time or Christmas week. So I doubt they're gonna be like appointments available. All right, you guys, so I am finally all dressed and we are about to head to Van Cleef first and then I'm gonna go to Saks Men. Um, to see if I can get him something for day three of our, you know, gifting and all of that. Um, I will show you guys the earrings. So I'm going to go exchange them for a pair of earrings that look like this. And I'm going to try to match it with the bracelet that he got me. Because the one that he got me, though it's Van Cleef. I need people to know it's Van Cleef. Like, okay, it's a subtle flex, subtle rich type of thing. I told you guys he's not a flashy person. Um, like, if you look at him, you don't know he has money and he can afford to, like, do these things that he's doing for me. Um, but he loves doing them for me, so that's all that matters. Like, I don't need him to be flashy. I like my men to be reserved and then, you know flashy towards their girlfriend and that is literally him so i'm going to show you guys the earrings he got me um yesterday so this is the box like i said i'm going to return this so so these are the earrings <laughs> they're van cleef they're nice and they're red which is not my favorite color either so I'm gonna go return these and get something more like this. And um, yeah, so we're returning this. And uh, this was, let's see, let's see. Those earrings were, I'm gonna cross out some things. Those earrings were $2,920 and tax was $182. So it came out to $3,102. Like, I'm like, listen, baby, if you're gonna spend that much money on a goddamn, um, oh yeah, let me, actually that's where his card is. Yeah. <laughs> that has the card. Oops, that has his name. 
I think it's more expensive than these ones that I have on. These ones I have on, I think, are like 25, 27 maybe. So I'm gonna go return these and, um, well not return, but switch them out. And if they don't have anything, cause he said they literally didn't have much in stock. And that is why he got me that earring. It was like the last pair of earrings they had. And he just wanted to get me something from there. So he told the lady to, you know, wrap it up anyways. So if they don't have anything better, like what I have in my ears right now, then I'm just gonna order it and have them ship it to the store and then I can pick it up anytime. Um, but it's so sweet and it's the thought that counts. <laughs> um, so yeah, so we're gonna go pick up our bracelet. Hopefully someone hasn't come in and taken it because he said he was gonna go pick it up today. But since I was gonna go in and exchange the earrings, I can pick it up. So hopefully no one has bought it. I have my Van Cleef 26K. Thank you, Holy Grail Daddy, period. And then I have the other ones. I don't know, it's all tangled up in my uh, Cartier bracelets. But I'm wearing it since I'm going to the Van Cleef, you know? Uh, I still never got it sized, but I don't care. So, thank you, Holy Grail, for these two. <laughs> so we're gonna go add another one that looks like this, but it's gonna be in a different color. Um, but yeah, so I never got this resized. I'm supposed to, but whatever. Um, and then, <laughs> thank you, Holy Grail Daddy. <laughs> For my $26,000 bracelet. I'm finna sell this thing because I really don't wear it. I think this is like my second time wearing it. Oh well. So I'm wearing jeans. I have on this um, bodysuit or leotard. I got it from White Fox Boutique when I ordered stuff from them. Chanel, what is the problem? <laughs> She's sitting in my freaking closet whining. Like you can get up. Like you can get up and come. You know that. Um, so like I was saying, I'm wearing jeans. These jeans are from Zara, I'm pretty sure. This is from White Fox Boutique and my Hermes boots that I just got yesterday. Now let me tell you something about these boots. Do not buy these boots if you don't have someone that you live with to help you take them off. The only reason I'm wearing them right now is because I'm going to go see him. We're going to dinner again today. But do not buy these boots unless you have a boyfriend or a husband or somebody you live with. Because let me tell y'all, trying to take these boots off, trying to take these boots off, oh no. It was like a struggle, okay? So just a heads up if you wanna go buy these Hermes boots. I didn't know that that was gonna happen when I bought it, but it is what it is. They're comfortable when you put them on, but to take them off, Mm -mm. Uh, all right you guys so i am done shopping i actually didn't take you guys with me because it's too much i had my purse and then i had to go through like you know to pick out stuff we don't want you with a camera in van cleef so obviously i wouldn't do that and then when i ran into Saks, it was kind of like a quick in and out but i am at bay's house <laughs> and we are going to open his gift by the way thank you guys for some of the girls who suggested what i should get him on instagram follow me on instagram <laughs> don't stare at me anyways cheers you're making me nervous <laughs> um yeah we're gonna open some gifts and then we're gonna have dinner and then i think where i'm gonna close this vlogmas tonight and then probably start another one tomorrow so We'll see, but I need to also finish my um, Turks and Caicos part two. That's gonna go up tomorrow, so make sure you guys are watching that vlog. Okay, consistency here, hello? Like, <laughs> help me open you're it. You're gonna lose the camera. <laughs> are you using it? Yeah, I was recording, but I'll show them after. Oh, this is his gift. I got him some perfume. <laughs> They're gonna be like, "What?" It's cute. I love them. It's white gold.
is for Eric, you love when I share it Let's talk about Frankie, I love when he's banging, you know what I'm on Cheers for Gerald, I'm at